What up, my people? This your boy, M Extra. Get that! Welcome to Extra Noise Fragrances. Man, we got about eight fragrances we about to talk about today. This is my top most complimented fragrances as of lately. Now, these most complimented fragrances are going to be not all time. These are just the most complimented fragrances that I've been wearing lately, roughly the last two months, okay? But first... Man, I got a special unboxing for y'all. Even though it's not an unboxing because I actually opened it already, but I did not smell it yet. And that is going to be, let me know, y'all ever heard of Dior Ohm Intense? I'm sure you have. So they also have Dior Ohm Intense Parfum, which is too rich for my blood. But then I, um, I heard about a clone of that fragrance. So I got a sample of that perfume a long time ago blah 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 I smelt it absolutely loved it but i wasn't paying 280 dollars for it so when this came out and i heard all the raving about gary's den and the price i paid 40 dollars for this roughly 45 dollars i had to get my hands on this i had to get my hands on this people were saying how good the quality was this and that but y'all know me People hype stuff up all the time. I don't believe them. So I had to find out for myself. Now, I do know what the Dior Own Parfum smells like, even though I don't have that sample anymore. That was like a year ago. But let's go ahead on and spray this, man, and see. I hope. Ooh, ooh, that's real powerful. Ooh, ooh, I'm about to drop it like it hot. Yeah, ooh, let's see. Mm, okay, definitely got that. Whew, that's strong. Woo <laughs> hmm. Now on this card, hold on, let me spray. Hmm, hold on, let me spray Dior Arm um, Intense because Parfum, if you know, does have a similar vibe, a real similar vibe to the Dior Arm um, Intense. So hold on, this is intense. Okay. Okay, yeah, all right. I was tripping, I was tripping, I was tripping. So, whew, this, bruh, this is high, now just like they said, this is high quality juice. This smells fantastic. Whew, now that it's calming down, it does bring that uh, Dior Own Parfum smell in the plate. But it also smells a lot like Dior Own Intense. I mean, which is not saying much because they're both kind of the same fragrance. Parfum just has a, is a little, it's a little darker, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, but the quality, I got to spray this on my skin. The quality on this thing is a fine, fine. Well, you can hit a bum, hit somebody a mile away with that spray. Hold on, let me see what's that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Man, look. Yeah, this going to get its own special review by itself. Oh, yeah. I want to spend a little time with this thing. You heard me? Um, See what the performance like, the longevity. Then I'm going to give it a final rating, but I am going to spend more time and give this thing its own video. Now, let's hop into my top list. This is my top eight or ten, however many fragrances this is, of my most complimented fragrances within the past couple months. These are in no particular order besides the number one because the number one is easily my most complimented. So let's start this video off. Let's start this list off with Gucci Guilty Elixir. I know this is gonna surprise y'all. Y'all see the dent I put in that thing? Do y'all see the dent? Bruh, now this got a, damn, this is, this fire. Every time, why you think I wear it so much? The women love this smell. It kind of um reminds me of um perfumes, the Marley, the silver bottle. What's the silver bottle? What's the silver bottle? I can't remember the name of it, but I'll put it right up there. This reminds me Pegasus. This reminds me of Pegasus from perfumes, the Marley. <sighs> this is fire, y'all. If you like Pegasus but don't want to spend an arm, a leg, a back, a breast, and a lip, get that. 
Next on the list. Okay, we're going to put these two fragrances as one because they damn sure smell similar and they damn sure both get me monster compliments. So it's going to be F9 Supremacy, not only intense, and it's going to be Versace Eros Energy. Man, man, man. You know what I want to do? I want to layer these together and see what type of reaction I get. This one is a little more sweeter than this one. They both got that um that Aventus DNA, but this one is a lot more sweet than uh, Aventus. And this one just blows Aventus out the water to me. This is beast mode performance too. This one got okay performance, but this is beast mode. Compliment monsters, both of them things. You hear me? Real talk. Next. Now this one is not one of my newer fragrances. But this is a fragrance that I just started to really wear because it costs so much, man. And that is um, Golden Dollar, the Coffee Break by Zerzhov. Man, bruh. This one of them fragrances, and I, this not no, when you hear coffee, don't think heavy, dense coffee. This smells like money. This smells like money. This is one of the few because y'all know how I am about expensive fragrances, you hear me? This is one of the few expensive fragrances that is worth every dollar. No pun intended. <laughs> you see how I did that? Bruh, this is fire. It smells like money. It smells rich. It just smells so confident. <sighs> I never smelled a coffee fragrance that smelled this good. This is a rich... I'm, man... Get y'all nose on this. Even if you got to sample it, I promise you this is worth the money. And nobody's talking about this, man. Next on the list, and this going to be second to last, and that is YSL Le Parfum Myself. This is YSL Myself Le Parfum. Let me show y'all how good this is because y'all think I'll be playing. Y'all think I'll be playing. I don't know. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see that? Man, look, the, the juice way down here. So good, I had to go buy another one. So good, I had to go buy another one. When I tell you, this is just, to me, the fragrance of the year as far as um, mass, uh, what they call it? Whatever they call it, crowd pleasing. This is going to be something everybody likes. This is so damn good. I like this better than the original myself. The Le Parfum is more sophisticated. This is sexy to the T. Bro, I promise you guys get this fragrance. One of my subscribers already listened to me and asked him about it. You hear me? Ask him about it. This thing, that thing on the thing, thing. Get that. Last but not least for show. Last but not least for show. It's going to be Scandal by John Paul Gaultier. Oh, Scandal. Now, as you can see, Scandal is still pretty high up at the top. And it's because I'm kind of letting it macerate. But every time a woman come over here, I let them smell this. And they all melt, melt when they smell this, man. This is definitely a panty dropper. This is definitely a top five panty dropper. This is one of them ones, man. This is one of them things on the fine thing. I'm not sure why a lot of people are not talking about this fragrance yet, but each and each time you rock this, it's going to be one of them fragrances that get better every time you rock it. You hear me? This your boy M Extra, man. Get that in the mood.